Thomas guides the ship into a water channel he knows well, despite the years since his last visit. Even in the darkness, the scoundrels can tell he's unsettled. Emerald Post, an out-of-place grand mansion built to resemble Thomas's family home. He is concerned the torches outside are dark. Before he can explain why that's a problem, a huge flaming insect flies into the clearing. As it flies towards the mansion, Thomas cries out. There are unstable <coughs> chemicals in his lab. A normal flame won't set them off, but the fireflies burn hot. He calls out for Wandsworth, his loyal and trusted manservant, but there's no reply. Thomas explains his alchemical torches keep the insects away when they're lit. Normally, Wandsworth makes sure they're always burning. If you're going to find out what's happened, the scoundrels must light the torches and stop the flaming fireflies from entering the mansion. Okay, that seems doable. Are those the normal ones, though? It's a mosquito. I can split everyone apart, yeah. It doesn't seem too hard anyways. And they jump back, okay. That flaming firefly coming in from the west it's transfixed by the blaze and flying towards the mansion. If it gets in there, the mansion will explode. Okay. Doesn't have high movement, just like in the cutscene. So, we good. Chemical torches require a complex procedure to light. Fortunately, there are instructions on the shell, assuming your scoundrel understands it. <laughs> Your scoundrel has prepared the base chemicals. Now they need to prime the ignition mixture. Buzzing in from the east is a flaming firefly with eyes only for the mansion. If you don't stop it, the mansion will explode in a blaze. Oh, the second one as well. Okay. Oh my god, those <laughs> are you of effect stuff. It has a lot of HP though. It's good he's here though. Have that, have that. Okay, nice. Torch's distinctive smell is already having a dramatic effect. Now to light the other three. 
You mean it's not gonna go that way? Another flaming firefly appears from the west, heading for the mansion. You better stop it. Oh, okay. I need to, like, carefully aim it. More insects emerge from the swamp to the northeast. Camera. I'll just punch him out of here. Your scoundrel needs to follow the procedure to light the torch. Ah, yes, that's half the torch is lit. These insects seem to have noticed what the scoundrels are up to, and they don't seem pleased. She needs help. More insects emerge from the swamp to the east. I need to back her up. Another flaming firefly appears from the east, heading for the mansion. Stop it! Damn, that's a lot of damage. Flaming Firefly exploded safely away from the house. <laughs> and yes, I realize that's an odd definition of the word safely, but the mansion is still standing. Mostly. Can I, like, pass them? <laughs> I screwed myself up here. Wait a minute. Oh, another flaming firefly appears from the west heading for the mansion. You better stop it. I was wondering where was Hammer. I can heal him. I don't know what I'm doing. Are you dead or...? <laughs> you can't do anything. There are two, but he will stop them. Oh, wow. <laughs> He needs to get there as soon as possible. <laughs> also, he is a rich boy. What the hell? A mansion? I thought the shrug it off will heal everything. It's like she's stuck. 
But she needs to be there. To merge from the swamp to the southeast. That's okay, though. I need like three damage, and she has a passive. Mm, it's a risk. Okay. Can you stop burning? Oh, thank you. <laughs> works okay sure it doesn't matter though it's fine your scoundrel needs to follow the procedure to light the torch your scoundrel has begun the lighting procedure Keep going to complete it. Nearly there. Just one more torch left to light. <laughs> it's just with table tops like that though. <laughs> Get out. And she's on fire. Oh wow. <laughs> if I move, I'll die, no? I didn't notice with the hammer. Stuck there. Another flaming firefly stopped from blowing up the mansion. Good work. <laughs> but everyone's on fire. It seems like this spell works only in close distance to the enemies. I don't know why. Hmm. 
Burning poison, burning poison, <laughs> Jesus. I think it's straightforward now. Oh, another flaming firefly appears from the west heading for the mansion. You better stop it. They're dangerously close now. Another flaming firefly stopped from blowing up the mansion. Good work. Another flaming firefly stopped from blowing up the mansion. Good work. Your scoundrel needs to follow the procedure to light the torch. Your scoundrel has begun the lighting procedure. Keep going to complete it. Another flaming firefly appears from the west heading for the mansion. You better stop it. Another flaming firefly stopped from blowing up the mansion. Good work. is lit! That's all of them! The swamp fills with the smell of Thomas's alchemical repellent. It's a bit unpleasant for the scoundrels, but clearly much worse for the insects. <laughs> Time to put out the fire and search what's left of the mansion. Which is, thankfully, quite a lot. Thomas heads inside, beating out the flames and calling for Wandsworth. There's no answer. But eventually, he emerges holding some items that might shed a bit of light on Wandsworth's fate. This charred note includes a sketch of a familiar figure. The assassins were here. But it's drawn next to a hastily written list of supplies. Wandsworth is, or was, alive and fled the island. There's also a piece of brilliant blue coral near the note. Thomas explains that he was studying it, believing it to have some special properties. It's supposed to be in a protective case. Why would Wandsworth remove it? Wandsworth couldn't have gotten far. In fact, there's only one place Thomas can think of. You'll have a chance to catch him if you move quickly. Okay. Fourth Raspel. Hold me fast, it was... Across the island. <laughs> <laughs> 